Oh shit. Don't turn twice. Please don't do that. Shit, shit. Okay, good. I'm doing so much better, actually. <laughs> so much better. Oh, you know what I forgot to show off? <laughs> this. Go <Right> away. <laughs> the policemen are pressing forward. Forgot to show that off. <laughs> it happens. Let's see. And the guy got pretty close. <clears throat> so is this guy. I have to kill him. Yep, it did. Okay. Oh fuck. Oh, cool. Damn it! I thought I could have got around him before. He got back up. Yeah. That's fine. Oh, sweet. Okay. Let me... Okay, we're back. <laughs> Let me explain why that worked that time. Um... And the, okay, the reason why I always thought it worked was because, remember when I said that I didn't know about that little shortcut right at the beginning of the game, and I was looped around? Yep. So I was looped around, and going by that um, car the first time, and then I went in back into the other room. Which, you're supposed to come back through that room after you go back through the door in order to trigger it. Now, because I didn't go by it the first time... Which is the re it's so weird. That's the reason why I didn't trigger it. Because that's a trigger point. Oh. You have to walk past the car one time. And then, then go through the door the and then come back. Yes. Exactly. That is so the trigger, trigger point. Event. Yep. Exactly. Okay. But uh, we're in a lot better shape this time. Yep. I completely wrecked this part this time. Okay. Healing, healing, healing. We'll save it, and then I'll take the other healing. Down. Down. Down with the sickness? All the time. Or is it down by 311? I don't know. Do you even know that song? Nope. Okay. <laughs> The radio morning show that I listen to, there's a guy on there. He, um, 311 is his absolute favorite band. I know <laughs> that song, and that's all I know, so. <coughs> Sorry, guys, I think my throat is a little dry. <laughs> okay. Four healings. Last time when I did my test playthrough, I only had three. So, oh, spoiler alert, yeah, there's the first match with... The nemesis coming up. <laughs> ring the bell. This soon? Before we even hit the ring? <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, I got four healings. When I did my test playthrough, I had three, but it took me like fucking ten tries to kill him. So, oh. yeah. But I'm better now, I think. I think. I'm still a little yep. nervous about it. <laughs> <laughs> Brad, you okay? Yeah, really. Brad, oh, oh, shit! Snap! It's <coughs> on! Uh-oh. Uh, Damn. And that's how he became a Zambo. Spikes through the face, I guess. Okay. Let's see if I can do this. I'm gonna try and be quiet and do this. And I'll explain what I do after this. 
so now there's random shit. I already fucked it up. Choice events that happen. He could have ran into the uh, police station and skipped the entire fight, but shit. That's yeah. not how we're doing this. Oh no! I died already. Damn. Shit. Okay. So here's what happened. When you're in green, fine. And you're on the ground, because the pushover doesn't hurt you. When he pushes you over, it doesn't hurt you. But if you're anything other than fine... That's why it's... Okay, sorry. Okay, let me back up. When you're fine, you can get back up really quick. Yep. If you're anything less than fine, it takes you a little bit longer to get up. And that's why when he grabbed me... Yep. That's why he could grab me. And that attack actually takes a lot of damage. If you're anything less than, like, 50% health, you're going to die from that. <laughs> so... If you're more than 50% health, you shouldn't die from it, but you're probably going to have to heal. And if you also notice, I was trying to, um... A new mechanic to this game is the dodge mechanic. Which, if you, um... Either push R, which is what I'm used to. R is the one that readies your weapon, R1. If you push R, has as he's attacking you, you'll dodge his attack. You can also press X while you're aiming it. So if you're holding R1, if you push X to shoot and he's um hit, trying to hit you, you dodge it. Yeah. I hardly ever can get that one to work. <laughs> so I always just put my gun down and then push R1 right when he tries to attack me. Yeah. That's the best way. So, I have 25 shotgun shells. I believe... I think... Do you have a... Um, you can probably look it up. There's a Nemesis hit point chart, and I think if I bury all my shotgun shells into them, I think I kill them. I think. Okay, let's try this again. I should have found that before we played this. Nice. Ah, you bitch. Mm. Ah, shit. That's not good. Oh, what? She got up. The bullshit on that! What? She got up! <laughs> she got up, James! I should have healed, actually. Because there should be... I can always look it up in between episodes, too, but there's yeah. a chart that somebody made... That tells you how many hits with each gun it takes to down him. To kill him. I'm trying, but... I think it's like 14 shotgun shells to down him the first time. Then it's like another 12 to actually kill him after that. If I remember correctly. <clears throat> I think... Like I said, I can always find it in between episodes, too. Not a big deal. I think I got this this time, anyway. Ah, shit. Oh, are you joking? Oh, good. Woo! Ooh. Shit. 
Oh, shit. No! Oh my god, I got away from him. Heal. Oh. <laughs> I popped into the wall. Nice. Oh, shit. Not dead yet, though, nope. guys. Nah, nah, he's just mad. <laughs> oh, what? He didn't attack he me. He juked you. Yeah, he did. <laughs> the button too late. Ooh. Should almost got him though. Come on, Jill, get up. I have to use it. so happy is this what you're talking about I believe so this isn't what I saw before but that actually looks better <laughs> okay oh oh and it shows you all the oh for all of them okay yep okay so for killing them, we... I'm so glad it only took me three tries we get the eagle parts a nice Okay, so we'll show you what happens when I get the other parts. Now, here's the gimmick. I can pick up the card case here, okay? If I didn't kill him or if I ran into the police station, would it give me a choice? Yep. Um, I would have had to find that in a different room in the police department. Yep. So it, you, you don't so now lose I got a Brad's. chance to get it, but you just no. lose a chance to get Brad's card. Exactly. So. <coughs> yeah, I think you actually find Jill's in here somewhere. Yeah. And look at this. They're Three just herbs. like, they're just like, we knew you were going to try and fight them, so. <laughs> give you a bunch of herbs here. I think I'm actually doing a lot better than I did in my test playthrough. Boom. We'll go for like another five minutes here because I don't know how much I have to cut out of this episode, so. Yep. So because we have the stars card. Oh, hold on. There's there should be bullets here. Is this a double stack? Yes, it is. Okay, cool. Nice. Because we have the stars card, we can just use it right here. If I didn't, I think I would have to go all the way to the... I think it's the classroom. Yep. I believe. I think it's at the front of the classroom. Yeah. And then I'd have to come back to do this. Due to an emergency, the key to the star's office has been moved to the evidence room. Today's password for the safe is 0131. Now that number changes between like three or four different numbers. So you do have to... You, it makes you check it every time unless you memorize all of the number combinations, I yep. guess. So... Um... Another thing... This room, make sure you kill all the zombies in here. And I mean kill them. 
it will help you out in the long run. You'll see why later on. Yep. <coughs> Even though you could probably already guess. <laughs> <laughs> there is one down here. Yep. Ah, you fuck. That's probably the easiest way to take care of him, but you do take damage for it. Yeah. After this episode, I think I'm going to need to get some water. <laughs> <laughs> okay. So... You probably going to get something, too. Is there one hiding in here? Oh, no, that's right. It's Marvin. Marvin! You know, it's really funny because he looks like he's dead here. He's been fatally wounded. Okay. Yep. But in 24 hours, he helps Leon and Claire, and he... I mean, he's wounded, but... And he... You know, but... I mean, it, what happened in 24 hours that it made him fine? Like, it, I mean, he's he's still wounded, but you know what I mean. Is he's he conscious. sleeping right now or something? Yeah, maybe he's just sleeping. Alright, September 24th. There are reports of a theft in the municipal building before dawn. A jewel-decorated clock at the main gate was damaged. Two of the 12 gems that are installed in the face of the clock are missing. Due to the lack of available officers at this time, I have no choice but to suspend research on this case. And suspend all the police officers in this case. <laughs> wow, Marvin! Damn! September 26th. Based on the autopsy... Okay. The autopsy report of a 42-year-old <laughs> restaurant owner, I have discovered that he has one of the missing gems. Apparently he took shelter in the police department at about 10 a.m., where he was shot to death within 10 minutes of having developing the symptoms. Damn. Like AIDS? <laughs> <laughs> Since the city is currently under martial law, we are forced to suspend suspend this case. At this time, we'll keep the gem as evidence. Signed, Marvin Brand. Uh -oh. So where's the gem, then? I uh guess we will find out on the next episode. Yep. <laughs> Alright, you guys. Until next time, take it easy. Bye-bye. I honestly can't believe it only took me three tries. I thought it would take me more. I thought so too. <laughs>